The mask mandate in Hamilton County has been extended reportedly one last time. Mayor Jim Coppinger announced today that he plans to let it end April 29th. Our Meredith Aldis joins us with how they say this timeline was decided upon and how concerns are being addressed by county leaders. Meredith. Craig, Mayor Coppinger says these next 30 days will allow time for people to get vaccinated as those 16 and older are eligible. We also wanted to not only allow people to be vaccinated, but also to give businesses uh, opportunity for preparation over the next 30 days uh, to gear back up to where they uh, where, where they were comfortable. Mayor Coppinger says businesses can still require customers to wear masks, but it won't be enforced by the county. If there's businesses out there that feel like they need to do it to continue to protect their employees, then that's what they need to do. Uh, just as what Dr. Johnson is doing with the school system. Dr. Brian Johnson says the mask mandate will remain in place for Hamilton County schools until the summer. He says he expects students to be in school five days a week in August, but hasn't decided if masks will be required then. As long as uh, this virus is in the community, we will have uh, some of it in our schools. Um, our goal has been, I think as we shared really early on, not to be a source of spread. Mayor Coppinger says the reasons why he and his team decided to end the mandate in 30 days is because hospitalizations are down, the number of people testing positive for COVID-19 is trending down, and the vaccine is now available for people 16 years and older. Together, we've come a long way. We've come a long way since last uh, March uh, to get to where we are, so we don't want to take any steps backwards. He says people still need to be careful when the mandate is lifted. You don't want to be the last person in Hamilton County to contract this virus. You don't want to be that last person, and you certainly don't want to be the last person to die from it. Health Department Administrator Becky Barnes says as of Monday, 14% of the county's population has been vaccinated. Dr. Adam Souffleris says a lot more people will need to get the vaccine in order to achieve herd immunity. Vaccines are really our way out. Although all the appointment slots for vaccines administered by the health department are filled, Mayor Coppinger says be on the lookout for more to become available soon. Reporting live in the studio, Meredith Aldis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.